Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to show you how to manage reviews and ratings on your site. So, in the last lesson, we created a digital product. Uh, you don't have to have this digital product, uh, but I'm just going to click on this one be just because we, you know, we just did it. Let's be the first to review this product. You can, on your website, review any product to see how this works. But we're going to click uh, Be First to Review. And of course we're going to give this five stars in quality, price, and value because it's a great product because I'm selling it. So we're going to have the nickname and this will be the user's nickname. So I mean they can be, leave their name as anything. So this is just me leaving this review and um, it was uh, magnificent. Okay. Nope. Oh, spelling error. Okay. Okay. Uh, album. That's great. Thanks. Okay, well, let's click Submit Review. So what happens now? Uh, now the user gets a, um, a message here that says your review has been accepted for moderation. Okay, so if we refresh this page or we go to this product again, um, you know what you're not going to see is you're not going to see um, uh, the review itself. So if we go to the actual product, there's details, product tags, whatever, but you're not going to see the review. So as an admin, you're going to want to check your site. And if you're getting a lot of traffic, you're going to want to frequently go in here and we're going to go to ratings and reviews. Um, and then we're going to do customer reviews and then pending reviews. So here are your pending reviews. Chances are uh, you'll either have you know none of these or a bunch of these. So if nobody's visiting your site, you might not get that many reviews. But let's say you have lots of reviews in here. You can actually batch approve them if you can just tell just by looking at here that it's not a spam. Um, so if you look at here and you see, you know, by somebody and they have all this information, it's a legitimate review. Um, you can click, um, you can just click this checkbox here, or you could click select all here. It doesn't matter. And then actions, you could do update status, change the status to approved, and click submit. Okay, total one record has been updated. Now if we go to reviews and ratings, under pending reviews, this will not show up. But let's check out all reviews. Okay, so here it is. And likewise, let's check uh, this manage ratings. If we come here, we can see that these are our ratings, right? So if you remember uh, when it, we asked to review the product, let's see, be first to review this product, although it won't be first anymore. Um, we have these options, quantity or quality, price, and value. Uh, you can have these be anything you want. So let's just click on one price, for example, and we can say this is awesomeness. Okay, and let's save the rating. So now that's actually gonna be awesomeness. We refresh this, uh, they, they've given it a five star on awesomeness, and this is the, um, the third one right here. Of course, you can create as many or uh, as few as you would like. You can come in here and delete them. Um, if you click on this, you can just click delete rating right up here. Uh, likewise, if you're back here on this page, you can add a new rating. Um, and they're going to show up here. So now, if you notice that we approved this rating, uh, it was magnificent review by Scott. The album was great. Thanks. Posted on this date. Here's our quality review. And if we want to leave another one saying, uh, um, Sucks. Um, awful. And I hate it. Okay. So let's just post this one. And again, it's going to go in for moderation. Now, if we come back here to reviews and ratings, all pending reviews, let's approve this one. Select all. Actually, let's approve it a different way. Let's click on it here. You can see here, this is the review. Okay. Cool. Let's save this. Oh, I'm sorry, let's change this status to approved, and let's save this, and now our review is no longer impending. We'll refresh our page here, or we'll come back to our product, and as you can see, it's uh, given us the review of three stars, because we've had two reviews, one of which was straight fives, and one of which was straight ones. Okay, so then you can see the reviews, you can sort them how you like, and uh, that is your reviews. So that's how you moderate and set reviews and how to edit them to be exactly what you want. If you have any questions or comments, as always, please leave a, uh, a comment on the video or hit us up at Twitter at Level Up Tuts. Once again, this is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and thanks for watching.